Abdul Rahman ibn Khaldun, the well-known historian and thinker from the Muslim 14th century North Africa, is considered a forerunner of original theories in social science and philosophy of history, as well as the author of original views in economics, prefiguring modern contributions. As a child, Ibn Khaldun received a classical Islamic education, which includes memorization of the Quran, along with a study of the Arabic linguistic, Quranic and Hadith sciences, fiqh, and sharia. He was also trained in mathematics, logics, and philosophy. As a young man, he entered politics and remained in the service of numerous rulers of North Africa. His last position was that of Grand Qadi, judge of the Maliki School of Thoughts in Egypt. A judge, university scholar, and a diplomat, Ibn Khaldun diligently recorded his thoughts and academic research, leaving behind a rich legacy for centuries to come. His lasting contributions to humanity is the Muqaddimah, the first book of his universal history, Kitab al-Abar, which means Book of Lessons. His analysis of the rise and the fall of civilization has formed the basis of social sciences, with the science of civilization and sociology. According to 1001 Inventions, Muslim heritage in our world, Ibn Khaldun was also a forerunner in terms of his economic theory, paving the way for economics as a new as we know it today.